Sometimes, your computer may feel used. Be sure to organize frequent date nights. Ignore the judgmental stares of other strangers. Place it right in your room to save time on travel. Sometimes, your computer be sure to set and get better. Make sure, make sure, and get an better. Be sure, some, place it right in your room. Be sure to, or, be sure to, or, like your thinking, but that's not how to use it. It's too high up. Get what's inside. Ah, uh, yes, like paper. No, I need it for. This better work. Jenkuya. Uh, no worries, dude. Hey, it worked. The door is back to normal. Except for this whole static thing. It feels like I'm dying. Greg, fix that goddamn router. It's been a week. My internet withdrawal symptoms are getting out of hand. I'm getting all sweaty. Do you know how super irritating it is having damp fur all day? <laughs> Funny you say that. I have an incredibly hairy chest. Shut up. Yes, Olaf, sir. And you still haven't fixed Krush's surveillance network. What's going to happen when we execute the final plan? Do you want us to be the next Neo North Korea? Yes, Olaf. I mean, no, Olaf. Good. Oh, and one last thing. I swear to God, if I catch you posting shit memes of me online again, I will murder you. Stupid. Those memes are dank delicious. Oh, jeez! You escaped my realm of errors already? I was planning that escape room for months! MONTHS! You mean it was just an escape room game? Neat. Well, man, it's all a part of the process. I'm happy to give you some feedback. Thanks, Paradigm. So, uh... Why didn't you, you know, rat me out to Olaf? Reason one, I needed someone to playtest my escape room. Hard to get good feedback these days, you know. Reason two, Olaf's new plan. Olaf's plan is better, replacing Claus's old one. If Olaf manages to execute it, that is. I'd have to set up an international propaganda network. Which means I have to do more than pretend the router is unfixable. I really can't have that. I've got camping and fishing trips to go on with the boys. 
And anyway, Klaus's original plan was way better than Olaf's. Do you know Klaus? How was Klaus's plan different to Olaf's? Yeah, we were pretty good bros. Used to play handball on Wednesdays. You see, you were the original key to the plan. Something something, the ultimate leader. Unite the world and end all conflict, yada yada yada. But Olaf was super jelly of you since he was only made to vomit candy bars. Hence the whole wanting to kill you thing. And I just realized telling you some of the plan may have, in fact, ruined the plan. So, um, I'm going to leave now so as not to mess things up anymore. What about the whole surveillance thing? Haha, <laughs> well, peace. You've just moved like 10 meters away. I can still see you. Yeah, well, pretend I'm not here and just reset the router. Forget anything I said about Klaus's original plan. That hit now. Thank God I can finally leave this glitchy hell. Now that I think about it, I should probably figure out his name before I start retrieving heads willy-nilly. One mutant can only adopt so many heads. Or I could collect a bunch of welfare from 200 heads. Nah, too much paperwork. Anyway, it's probably written somewhere around the lab. Hmm. 
now that I think about it, I should probably figure out one me nah. Anyway. to stand uh, over there now. From what I can see, the scrolling text is just a social media feed of various animal joke accounts. Well, owner threw a ball and I couldn't find it. I'm still looking for it. It's eating me up inside. Hey, uh, do you know the name of the scientist guy? I don't know, man. I can't even remember the name of my sister's boyfriend. He is permanently called Man. Anyway, it's probably written down somewhere in this room. I've got this, <laughs> this really funny story. Sure, let's hear it. <laughs> well, it's the funniest thing. Me and my friend <laughs> went to the post office and they... <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> and like... <laughs> my friend is being all funny and stuff. <laughs> this uh, story was a lot funnier in my head. <laughs> yeah. I've got to go feed my dog. Okay. So many post-it notes and all of them say, buy more post notes to look more organized ASAP. Signed Reginald Yoprasotosovki. Must be that torso's name. mine now head oh wait uh, hang on I best use the shopping bag to make sure no one thinks I stole anything I know the machine can't kill me. I'll consider it. Gotta collect them all. Limby Mon. Doesn't have quite the same ring to it. In other words, I need the scientist limbs before I can use it.
Communal fridges are where leftovers go to die. Rest in peace. May your moldy covering bring you forgiveness. You are listening to the fridge, baby. First of all, you better wrap your leftovers while I wrap. The door was left open, the room is colder. Forget the toaster, I'm the illest in the kitchen. Knocked out the foreman grill, put the sink in a submission. You should listen, mister, got a real chill bargain. Those opposed wind up on a milk cart. Still starving, chasing pellets like some Pac-Man. Your girl is getting seconds, got her hands up in my snack bin. Oh. And I'm relaxing, the coolest of the coolers. I keep it fresh any less you flush into the sewers. Make maneuvers, I'ma make sure your food's gonna last I'm the fridge, baby I'll survive a nuclear blast If there was anything I wanted in my life It definitely is a wrapping fridge It's too high up I can't reach it. If only I was a noodle hand mutant. There's probably something else I could use. Free limbs for everyone. No, wait, I need these. Nice spoon is... Hey, uh, do you mind if I take this? Frankly, I don't do much Lansing these days. Oh, yes. It's enchanted, too. His name is Larry Lancy. Just ask him nicely and you can summon or unsummon him. Larry Lancy? Keen to ride with me? Yes, let us unite and bring pain and suffering to our enemies. And then drink some cold brewskis over their corpses. Also show, even if you are crafted for murder, you can go against the grain and do something positive. Summon Lance Larry. Attack leg. Goodbye, fleshy mortal. I must go back to my realm. Later, Larry Lancy. I love fantasy magic. Nice calves. What will it take to convince you? 
There are only two things in this world that would convince me. A Swedish foot rub, or equal rights for severed limbs everywhere. Viva la limba lotion. I'll see what I can do. Auf Wiedersehen. I don't need it anymore. I'm more of an organic space dust kind of guy anyway. there yet. I think I need to go there first before it unlocks. Troubleshooting mode activated. Please input security code button sequence now. Press again to exit troubleshoot mode. I think it's time to put in that code. You know, I got this bright idea. I think you should put in that code. Skibbity bop, bit a bop bop, put in that, put it that, put that code, skibbity bop. Hmm. I was sitting alone and I thought to myself, you should put in that code. Hey, Matt, I got some life advice for you. Put in that code. You know what is a beautiful day for? Putting in that code. Wrong. Cody code. Code. I think you should put Radio in that code. Mode now activated. Thank you for calling maintenance. Someone will be ready to help in ninety one thousand two hundred thirty four hours. Also, if this is Bob, the maintenance man, for God's sake, stop forgetting your maintenance code! Write down the elevator button pressing sequence somewhere. If you're going to write it somewhere nearby, like last time, write it in riddle form so others can't use it. Warning! Any non-maintenance personnel attempting repairs will be bitch slapped if they do not keep it cool. I'd like to avoid any bitch slapping uh, while the option is there. Also, if this is Bob, the maintenance man, for God's sake, stop forgetting your maintenance code! Write down the elevator button pressing sequence somewhere. If you're going to write it somewhere nearby, like last time, write it in riddle form so others can't use it. I can see how this went down. Jerry, I love your design, but you know what? I also love fish. Can we get the fish in there? That's a terrible idea, but because you're paying me, okay. Nice. Portable cellular phone is a loose term. As the sign says, out of order, or roughly translated, 
This will never be replaced till it permanently maims someone. Hello, Protégé Child Hologram. I would like to purchase a cupcake, please. Sure. Do you have cash, membership, or a coupon? No, I, I don't think so. No cupcake for you. See ya. I'll peruse your cupcake selection later. This isn't a cupcake library. Make sure to bring a coupon or cash. Sure, that's how advertising works. There's a rule somewhere that waiting rooms always have to have outdated magazines. Break the rule and the universe will implode, collapsing in on itself. Breadsticks will not help me on my quest, unless I want to throw an average party with people I don't even like. Nice, I can use this with my dupagin. Stop trying to use it to feather your nefarious puzzle-solving goals. to Olaf's waiting room. How may I help you? I'd like to talk to the sloth. All right, lad. What's your name? Paradigm. Wait. Uh, that was dumb. Ah, yes, you're right here. You're not scheduled for autopsy till tomorrow. Sorry, you'll have to wait until then. I can hardly wait. Do I get a bowl of ice cream after? Well, you'll be pickled and jarred after the procedure, for future reference. But I think I can arrange that. Just make sure to leave a good review on RateMySecretary.com. I need to go save some damsels in Budapest. Don't you mean distress? 
I think I know a little bit more about knighting than you. It opened some other way. It opened some other way. It's the door that I assume. I can use this with my Dupagin. Oh my, you poor soul. I'm so sorry the glam metal gods cursed you with such a head. Have a toffee. Thanks? You're gonna have to grab it out of my cleavage. My hands are busy at the moment. I'm not sure if I want... Just take the damn toffee! Yeah. My hands are super sticky from the toffee. I hate sticky hands. I'd rather be punched in the face and have it over with. Also, attached to the toffee are my digits on a piece of scrap paper. Just ignore that. I'm not hitting on you. I'm not that into the terminally ill. Can I have some of your donation money? Like you said, the glam at the gods did not look kindly upon me. Oh my, I wish I could, but our holy book is against giving money to people who have no chance to live. Wait, what? Let's be realistic, you don't have much time left. Come on, I'm only ill in a hip-hop sense. I'm not dying. Shush, shush, son, accept your death. Go on a bender, you'll feel much better. Besides, we mostly give money to the homeless. It's all in the great and sacred glam metal codex. Accessible to all glam metal churches via the .nfo stations. Are you sure you don't want to give me some charity money? Don't ask again. Look at you. You're about to die. It's against my beliefs. Read the .nfo file on the terminal. Maybe the gods of Glam will go easy on you. Thank you, Twisted Sister, for your time. doesn't have any handles. Just like I have no handles in my life.
this is pretty cool. They're all connected together to work as one big supercomputer. I wonder what groundbreaking calculations they're performing. Wow, it's calculating the cure for cancer. Sorry, uh, I lied. It's just torrenting copious amounts of mediocre, naughty sitcoms. What am I supposed to do again? Ugh, go collect all the scientists' limbs. One head, two arms, and two legs, and put them all in the machine. Then you can ask the scientist dude about Olaf's weakness. Can you tell me more about the best? Pretty self-explanatory. We are people against generally shitty things. I've got to go feed my dog. Okay. Yeah, do it again. It's a plastic dying plant. I was not aware there was a market for a shitty broken down house decor. Nah, I'd rather not. Doug thinks that plastic plants are an insult to his species. But which species is he a part of? I always forget. Hello, high-fiving arm. Break an arm. <laughs> Get it? It's funny because I hate myself for telling that joke. Scientists are hot. You're goddamn right. Nothing makes me swoon like women who are masters of quantum mechanics. With them, you get lucky and get rejected simultaneously. I don't think I could ever pick up confidence like this. I will use this information. I know she didn't want me to have it, but she might change her mind. Got to delete Newton Facebook and hit the gym. Whatever that touches, it's going to get sticky. Just like... I'm sorry. There isn't any good innuendo here. Whatever that touch... I'm sorry. There... Just like... I'm sorry. I prefer to use it on police helicopters. Like... Nice spoon is... Whatever that touch... I'm sorry. Whatever that touches... I'm sorry.
Troubleshooting mode activated. Please input security. Press again to exit troubleshoot mode. I think it's time to put in that code. You know, I got this bright idea. I think you should put in that code. Thank you for activating manual maintenance override. Please, Bob, try not to make it worse. I'm a maintenance man. I'm a maintenance man. Maintenance man. Maintenance man. Forever, no. Whatever the time, sorry. I really don't need. I really don't need the hand to. St I need to save. Thank you, science, for allowing me to have a Swedish human without the messiness of natural reproduction. What would you say if I had an instant Swedish person with me right now? Would an instant Swedish person compacted into box form do the trick? I'm sure they can offer a Swedish massage. You know what? That's extremely insensitive. But you are correct. 80% of Swedish people know the age-old techniques of Swedish massage. Let's check out the goods. I... I wasn't sure what I was expecting. <laughs> Whatever. I've had enough of this glam metal thing. Animal prints don't suit me anyway. Go ahead and pick me up. Gotta collect them all, Limby Mon. Doesn't have quite the same ring to it. In other words, I need the scientist Limby Free limbs for no. He won't be passive-aggressively pushing stuff off your table. For your effort, I'm going to give you an honorary membership to Paxt. It includes a free cupcake. They're super delish. Anyway, I'll go get the machine started. You just press the yellow button. Here goes nothing. Engage determination face. Activate multiverse method destroying failsafe. Full insane is go! It's pants loot. Activate pants. Form fashionable legs. Form arms. Attach below average hit. Ugh. 
Hey, I'm back. That was pretty weird. Oh! Oh god, it hurts! Make it stop! Go ask him how to defeat Olaf. Quick, just in case he dies. I don't want to die! Who said anything about dying? How do I defeat Olaf? Dude, I literally just came back from the multidimensional plan. I'm all messed up. You don't want to know where my genitals are. It was torture. The guy kept telling me dead jokes. It was the worst. And now you're asking me all these heavy questions, man. Bad vibes. Hey, I met that guy as well. I feel your pain. Oh, right. Hmm. I guess Olaf is a dick anyway. I don't actually know. But I do know where you can get some juicy goss that'll go viral on the net, destroying his public image. I'll cast the clickbait curse. I'll be some sort of internet wizard. Is there anything quicker than a long con public smear campaign? All hail ultimate party pooper. May your poopery hail for thousands of years. Yes, there is another way. Topo Genetics has a space station which they went halfsies on with a local pickled cucumber company. It's actually amazing how much power they hold over Eastern and Western Europe now. Anyway, Topa Genetics holds all their sensitive documents there, including Olaf's genetic file. All you need to do is insert this floppy into the main computer and voice activate it with the password I don't know what to say, oh shit, is it recording? I'll take it from there. Please don't tell me I need to use the teleporter again. Don't worry! It was originally designed for this station so that we could figure out why the operator went out of radio contact. Then, to save some of that cash money. <sighs> Only downside really is the 1000% of your daily radiation intake needs. You should be fine though. Press the yellow button three times and you'll be good to go. No time for that. I have to... How about it? I'll give you a buzz, dude, once you get there. Cheers. Laters. Helvete. Soto curva. Bro. Hey, dude, it's me. How you doing, buddy? We have a private voice as Oh, right. Dupa Genetics was working on a real-time translator. Forgot about that. As well as the clone machine. <laughs> Pretty cool. Could this thing go off? It was actually one of its many problems. You need to turn it off, otherwise you can't say the password correctly. Well, you probably won't be able to say anything correctly, really. The translations it makes are... laughable. And occasionally don't even work. Good luck! Peace! Yanta, who for shit the Vigix here? I spent a lot of time in Ikea. Oh yeah, Swedish meatballs. Oh, <laughs> 